Hey guys, what's up? It's Sean, Autotopia LA. Today we're here with my friend, Tony. I have a true love for Panteras. I have a true love for GT40s and everything for combination. GT related. Yeah. It is a combination and you really did it good because this is, let's be honest, dude, the, the choices that you made on this, if it wasn't done just right, it could have been, you got kind of a disaster <laughs> of a car, you yeah. know, but how long have you had it for? So we've, I think I've had it 11 years, basically stock, probably drove it for a couple months, but I always wanted white body and, and 180 degree exhaust. So we started with one thing and it just escalated and then we spent three years building the car. Building the car. So first and foremost is, is the white body. I bought a front end, a damaged GT front end clip. So we bought a GT front end that was damaged so we kind of fixed it to see how it would fit to the car. And then and we that's just, from the 05, 06 era? 05, 06, yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So then we made a metal template to weld to the car because that GT is plastic. And then once we did the front end, we had to carry the back yeah. and did the same thing in the so back. So this is actually a modified Ford GT front Mod end? Yes. So headlights, because that's not the same size as no, a Ford no, GT. The, I know it's So not. I bought the Ford GTs. They just wouldn't fit because this car is narrower. Yeah. So these came like a, it was a RX-7 or something like that. I had to make them work on this because, well, it's aftermarket RX-7 basically. Right. And then like the taillights, those are factory Straight Ford, Ford GT. GT. Yeah. The only other thing other than that that we carried from the GT was the switches, the light switches, the fans, all that. We use those switches. So now engine wise, is it, so, this isn't what came with the No, car. so it came with the Cleveland. Okay. This is a Cleavor. So this is a 454 cubic inch Cleavor. So it's, okay. a, so it's a Windsor block Cleveland heads. And then the Got intake, it. and then the intake is special because the degrees are different than a small block or a big block. Okay. So it's a small block, fast turning RPM and big block heads. So it's rated at 600 horsepower. And this car weighs how much? 2,800. <laughs> we actually added more weight to it. It's got a full roll cage that's welded throughout the body to try and keep the car from flexing. So I added sure. more weight, yeah. but in the long run, you know, I wasn't worried about, you know, making I mean, it light. 800 pounds yeah. and 600 horsepower it's is still, a beast, It's dude. Still, a, still a beast. Yeah. Still. And it's fun to drive. You have the engine right behind you. Yeah. It's like, what more can you want? Yeah. Is there chassis work done to this? So there's to... chassis work uh, underneath. There's structural support on, on the back end of the car and as well on the front end of the car. Mm -hmm. So the, the way the, it's, it's 180 degree and they're, they're tuned. Like if you look at, the, at this exhaust, two go over there, these two come this way. So they, they, they combine. So we wow. did that, we put this heat shield and it's got the logo for De Tommaso. How about the, the transaxle So the this? transaxle is the same as the GT40s, the original 66 oh. GT40. Oh. It's, a, it's the German CF. We came up with this just to keep, try and keep the exhaust pipes hitting the body. Right, if you, you know, if you look over here, there's just a, a hole where it goes through and... So this allows for some movement, but it limits the movement. It, 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 yes, <laughs> it'll limit. <laughs> what a cool idea. I'm sitting here looking going, <laughs> what are the shocks for? You know, what's so this? basically is this? just the exhaust, just to help the exhaust wow. keep it in place. Now I noticed when you pulled in, I guess I never saw this before, it's, the car's on air. It's, it's got air right, yeah. Uh, right tech makes the shocks that are on this. Is this the shock wave? Is that what this? Y yes. It is, it okay. Is. Did you do, did, did you have it built by somebody or did no, you do so we a lot did of, everything in house. But, but you're not a builder. You're, you're, no, you're, we're not a you're builder. You're in a whole different business. Whole different business. <laughs> <laughs> this is just love. Did you do paint and body in house also? In house, yeah. It did a hell of a job. I mean, you, oh, no, seven years ago doing this. Yeah. And, and I know you, you know, this isn't a garage queen car. You, no, a trailer so we, queen, we, you drive this. We drive it. So. Yeah. But yeah, so he basically painted it like three times trying to get everything detailed on it. We recess the floors. We make the seats, so you're basically sitting on you're the ground. You're sitting on the floor. You're sitting on the floor. <laughs> that gives it more room. Is that comfortable? Not really. <laughs> not at all. It's not comfortable. So the seats are totally handmade seats? The seats are handmade. Like I said, the flooring was handmade. <laughs> that, that plexiglass, you can see the engine. That is so cool. You can see the engine right there. What, now, what are you doing on here for brakes and wheels and what are your wheel sizes and tire sizes and... 
So wheels are rushed forth wheels. Yeah. And so the front wheels are 11 by 18 and, and 255s. Okay. On the front. Mm -hmm. The rear are 19 by 13 and those are 355s. Well, man, if there's nothing we haven't covered in the build, let's let's get some cameras in and go. For, I want to go for a ride in your car, man. Definitely. Rad. Definitely. Cool. Let's do it. people asking you what is this car do they not know it's a Pantera so most people associate the Pantera and and they'll get a, a hint that's got a GT vibe yeah. on it yeah you know. yeah thought when you got on it like that I, I I was I gotta admit I thought there'd be more tire spin yeah but it, it really seems to grab and go doesn't it yeah horsepower what's your torque on this you got to be high fives or into the yeah. sixes even right I mean I'm getting planted in my seat <laughs> like you are throwing me into my seat hard I've been waiting for this for probably about three years now. I knew this was gonna be awesome shooting this car. I just didn't know it was gonna be this good. This car is everything it looks like and even more. I'm so stoked we finally got to shoot the Black Panther Pantera. Hope you guys had fun hanging and watching what we do today and I will see you in the next one. All right, man, later. Later.